Hey, John here from FastX. In this video, I'm going to take a look at Tailwind, which is a Pinterest pinning software. It's cloud-based and allows you to schedule pins uh, throughout well into the future. So I'm starting off on the schedule page. And this schedule, you can manually set up and you can add time slots any day of the week. So as you add them, and then when you go in and you pin, whether you pin individually or you bulk pin, that'll just drop them. The pins will drop in the order of that you have your schedule set up for. So really what this software is all about is bulk pinning or individual image pinning from URLs. And what I'm going to show here from this URL, you can also do directly on Pinterest and repin very, very quickly in bulk with this software also. So what you do is you need the Chrome extension. It's free. And you click that. And what it's going to do is this is great. And notice how fast that was. That I love that. I think Tailwind is really fast. It's just super cool. So all the images on the page on this URL pop up like this. And we can now pick and choose which ones to pin in bulk on a schedule to our Pinterest account. OK, so let's just click some nice beach photos. There we go. And at the bottom right, you click Go Schedule. Now you have several scheduling options in the pop-up panel. The well, first is, is you want to assign a board to all of them all at once. This was bulk assigned, so when you click a board here, they're all going to go to that board. But let's say you want to also assign a specific board to one or two of the images. You can also customize that for each image. You can edit the description or leave as is. And if you set it up, you can also uh, connect your Facebook account on Pinterest to enable sharing. Um, so you can do that as well. Now, scheduling options, you have a few of them. First off, you can just individually add them to the queue right now, or you can individually set a custom time. So what this would do, this would allow you to pin at a custom time that's external to the queue you've set up. So, you know, if you wanted to do it now, or if you want to like, pin it now, or if you wanted to do it at a very specific time, outside of the queue, that's what you do. But generally what you're going to do, especially when you're doing bulk, is you're just going to schedule all. So you've got them all lined up, you've got them all formatted, ready to go, and then you just hit schedule all and that's what it'll do. It'll just schedule them all into Tailwind and they'll drop in the order um, and so they're in your schedule and they'll drop according to your schedule. The last feature I want to show you is uh, the save draft, which don't know, I can't imagine myself a reason that I would use that, but I'm sure some people might find that useful. And you can just do, so let's say you're doing some power painting, you're just loading up your stuff, but you don't want to actually go through and edit uh, different pins at this point. You could just do a save for later. It doesn't drop in the queue, but you've, you've got save drafts ready to go, and you can go ahead and edit them and get them ready for pinning in the future. So the last feature I want to show you with Tailwind is this, and it's you can look at your published posts, I should say pins, and you could actually reschedule. So if you have a pin that performs really well, you can go ahead and reschedule it, and you can reschedule it at a specific time and date, and it will get uh, repinned later into the future. Now, Tailwind doesn't have what's called a, a recycling or an inventory concept where you can de designate uh, pins as evergreen or put them in inventory so they'll automatically drop if you ever don't have any pins scheduled. As far as I can tell, at least this doesn't have that feature. Um, I don't think that that's important. I don't think repinning regularly is a great practice for Pinterest. By all means, do it here and there, but I wouldn't do it as a, as a regular part of your social media strategy with Pinterest. So I don't think that's a big deal. So uh, for the price, which right now in here, I'm using a free account with Tailwind and it's got great features for a free account. The next price is I think $9 or $9.95 for a plus account, which is, that's per month. That's very reasonable for, uh, getting software like this. I also use viral tag. I primarily use viral tag. It has uh, a few other features, works with a few other social media channels, but it also costs quite a bit more. So that's what you have to keep in mind. Uh, I love the speed of Tailwind. It's really fast. It's got the basic features. It focuses on Pinterest, does a really nice job with bulk. Uh, if, if the features you saw in this video are what you need to, uh, you know, take your Pinterest pinning to the next level, then this is good software. I like it. Thanks for watching.